Hey guys, it's Redstone Ray here, and I'm trying something new and different. I am going to get together like five facts from something that's game related, and I'm gonna present them to you. Right now, you probably already know what I'm gonna say or talk about. It's Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. You should know this because you already clicked on the video. You probably had Scorpion in the thumbnail and the title. So if you don't know that, you're stupid. Just leave. Okay, so let's start off. Fact number five. If you've ever paid attention to Nether Realm's logo, you'll quickly realize that that's actually Scorpion on the logo. And that's because Nether Realms was founded, or not really founded, created in 2010 when it replaced Midway and Warner Brothers Games Chicago. And it got Scorpion from the Mortal Kombat series. And it's like, you know what? He's the most popular character. Let's just put him on there. And it works. Fact number four Scorpion's toasty fatality has appeared in the most Mortal Kombat games with a total of nine. I'm not going to name them all, but it's the most used fatality. It's awesome. People love to use it. Yay. Woohoo. Bam. Fact number three. You'll realize that Scorpion has a famous catchphrase when you use his spear too many times, and he will say, Get over here! And a lot of people have been paying attention to that, and a lot of people that work on other games have realized that it's super famous so it's appeared in a couple other games too as easter eggs or nods as an example there's a trophy slash achievement in the 2013 Tomb Raider titled get over here and it required the player to fire a rope at an opponent and pull them off an edge five times and it's been appeared uh, it's been appeared that's whoa it's appeared in a couple other games I'll just give a few examples the chain knife weapon in Terraria has a tooltip that says Scorpion's phrase, and also Pudge from Defense of the Ancients shouts get over here while hooking an enemy. Fact number two, Scorpion was absent from Mortal Kombat 3, and the most accepted explanation is that the developers had to rush the game because of a looming deadline, but it could also be because Midway didn't want to have ninjas in the game. Mortal Kombat 3 wasn't really a fan favorite, people really didn't like it, and people were mad not only because Scorpion was missing, but Raiden was missing too. Those are two super iconic Mortal Kombat characters, and I believe they've been in every Mortal Kombat since. So there's a lesson to you, Nether Realm. Don't leave out any awesome characters like Scorpion, even though for some reason Sub Zero was still in Mortal Kombat 3. He, he came back in Mortal Kombat 4, and what a surprise, he began picking up Steam again. Want to know why? Because Scorpion was in it, and people love Scorpion. People love playing as Scorpion. People love killing people as Scorpion. It's awesome. Fact number one. Scorpion has appeared in a ton of stuff. He's appeared in 17 games, two live-action movies, an animated movie, a live-action TV series, a cartoon series, a web series, a short film, a comic book, and three novels. That's insane that a character is used that many times, and he started out from a video game. And the first movie he was in was obviously the first Mortal Kombat movie, and it's the fourth highest-grossing video game movie of all time, behind Tomb Raider, Prince of Persia, and a... Pokemon Pikachu thing woo yeah so yeah woo there's five facts from scorpion into the video